Hello friends, welcome back on stitchingmall.com. Today I'll show you a princess line kurti or a top or a tunic that you can stitch, make with a front blanket and loop sleeves. So first of all, we take about one and a half meter or slightly more. I took a little less than two meter fabric. I folded it wrong side out and uh, front and back we are cutting together then we mark the top straight line basically we need a basic pattern of a kurti or kameez or a tunic so if you already don't know how to do that you can follow this basic pattern making for the basic uh, kameez or kurti so we mark the armhole length formulas are mentioned if you have any doubts you can ask me in the comment section below this video then we mark the hip length and the total length that we need we can take even if you want this uh, dress to be as long as your ankles you can even make it longer like that or you can make it shorter like a crop top so here we mark the chest line right now I'm just extending the lines and later on I'll show you how to mark on that so we mark the lengthwise markings so these are the lengthwise and the hip line I got on 21 inch depending on your length you can mark it slightly a few inches a few centimeters higher or lower and the total length I took about 30 inches you need one and a half inch for bottom fold and a half inch more for your shoulder seam so total length plus two inches more then we mark the neck width formulas are mentioned I am taking three inches wide then half inch down for the shoulder slope Maximum, if your shoulders are very stoopy, you can take 3 4 of an inch. Then we mark, mark the back neck length. I am taking about 2 inches. You can take, if you are adding a collar, you can take 1 inch. And then shape the back neck. Then front neck length 4 inch. Depending on your choice, maximum you can take is 7, 7 inch or least you want is 3 and a half inch. Then we mark the chest line. I am taking about 9 inch and for the armhole thing, I am taking half inch inside. Now you may wonder why sometimes I take half inch, sometimes no inside and sometimes one inch inside it all depends how fit you want it on your across chest or on your chest line how fit you want your armhole to be so here we mark we shape the armhole and half inch from the the upper one upper line we mark out for the out for the back part of dress then we mark the waistline that should be the fourth part plus half inch for the looseness and the hip line plus half inch for the loose loose thing now the bottom that you can take same as the hip line or maximum like here for a straight fit kind of a thing we want just half inch more than the hip line Here you can mark with this uh, curry scale or with your regular scale Dep depending on the looseness or the flariness of the top that you want. Now keeping about half inch from the side you can shape from the bottom. Now this was the basic thing. Here I'll show you two methods. First cutting this top without Flare. So here from the middle on the waistline I am taking 4 inch from the folded side and center of the armhole 
we'll give it a shape we'll give it a curve and bottom also we are marking it 4 inch from the bottom and then we join these markings and here we go up to give it a shape now I extend 2 inch from the sides this is for the seam and this would also cover the extra fabric that we'll be stitching on for that princess line curve. So this is your without flare top. Here the basic thing is done. We'll cut the outlines, remove the inner side that is back part of the top and then cut the curve of uh, neck and armhole and this thing would be done the will cut on the princess line now the second method that is the flare method and here you can add the goddess from the waist till the bottom to make the most stylish gown or a dress so here i show how you go about it see we made that basic princess line thing and I take about 2 inch from that inner that this inner line that we made from that we can take maximum like 2 inch or 4 inch or still 6 inch white marking from like this middle line you can see I take just 2 inch because I don't need my top to be very flary and it this marking has to go till the waistline, the middle of the waist where we have already marked. Here you can see and pay attention how it is marked. And on the back, on the left outer side also, we had already marked the seam side seams. Apart from that, out of that, I am marking 2 inch extra for the side flares. Seam allowance, you have not to adjust for this 2 inch thing because this is separate than, than seam allowance. Here you got a frog kind thing or a, that got it kind of thing and a more flary bottom. From the bottom, we take 1 inch up for the shape. Now we cut the back neck, shoulder, outline of the armhole. And outline of the top. This is the same process of cutting which we will follow while we will be cutting even without flare top. So the cutting method would be same. Just that 2 inch or 6 inch as flary as you want. You will mark and cut the fabric accordingly. This is a very simple method. And we are cutting it without cutting paper patterns. So it is, it saves your time while you are in a hurry to cut and make it in a jiffy. So here we cut it and inside the princess line thing. If you want it straight, then cut straight on that white line, inside line. If you want it flary, then cut it on that flary outer line. Here we got our pieces separate. Now we remove the inside that I have already removed inside and this is only the upper side, the front part of the dress. So we cut the front neck and the armhole. Be very careful because I couldn't show that. And uh, now we cut the placket. I am cutting it as long as the waistline that is total about 14 inch. You can take it more or less so here we got our top cut and uh, this i again emphasize that uh, front neck and front armhole you will be cutting separate than the back part you will remove the back part in the next video i'll show you how to make the placket or the button putty and finish the neckline and uh, how to stitch the loop sleeve 
how to make the snap buttons and join princess cut panels and make this beautiful top or dress so stay subscribed keep watching keep sharing goodbye take care